guys, Mesha with Joy Tech, and in this video, I'm going to be talking about what I just got from the pre order, which is the Huawei P30 Pro. You can see right here, I got it in black, of course, and this is the 256GB variant. So, on the side note, sorry for not posting any video for a long time because I've been really busy with work. But anyway, I got this today. I ordered it on the 2nd of April when it launched in Malaysia. And it's supposed to come with another diving case, or should I say snorkeling case, but it hasn't arrived yet. I'm still checking on when is the ETA for that item. So from the pre-order, we get this Huawei one terabyte backup solution, which is pretty hard to find in stores. And also the snorkeling case, both are worth almost a thousand ringgit. So it's almost a thousand ringgit discount from the selling price of the T30 Pro. Okay, so we'll be taking a look at this in another separate video. So let me put this to the side. Let's focus on the P30 Pro itself. So this is the 256GB variant of the Huawei P30 Pro. You can see I'm really excited because I actually used the Huawei P20 Pro for almost a year now. And the phone hasn't let me down, except for maybe the software side, which sometimes bugs out. But it's a very reliable phone, I should say, especially in the GPS department. Okay, so you can see the box is pretty standard Huawei Affair, which is a Leica quad camera. The quad camera, in terms of the fault camera, is actually a time of flight sensor which actually detects depth information. So you can see P30 Pro Huawei branding. Okay, let's slice open this box. I'll just make this video quick because I'll be doing more camera tests in the future. So stay tuned for that. So you can see P30 Pro on the side as well. Okay, let's slice this box open. So in Malaysia, we actually get the 8GB RAM variant, so which is pretty good. It's pretty high spec. I wanted to get the 512GB variant, but I was thinking I don't need so much storage. So it's not necessary. Okay, taking off the lid, you can see inside the box, nice touch here, Huawei design. And on the side note, actually I'm using the Mi Mix 3 to film, so you tell me in the comments how the quality is. Okay, so you can see P30 Pro with an in-display fingerprint scanner right here. As well as on the back, you can see the camera setup. Okay, so we're getting back to that in a second. I hope they have a screen protector applied though. Uh, I don't think I see any. So anyway, moving all that to the side. Okay, at the bottom here you can see SIM ejector tool, standard Huawei affair. You can see there's also a TPU case. Let me just take it out for you to see. See, same as the P20 Pro, nice TPU case. Good thing that they include that in the box. Okay, just put that to the side. What else do we have? Warranty card, as well as a, probably a quick start. Yes, a quick start guide. So that's about it for the second tier. Let's move on to the last tier, which is a regular USB-C cable, which supports Huawei Fast Charge or Super Charge. And also this 40 watt supercharger, which I heard is excellent. And I'm waiting to test it out. And I'll let you guys know, I'll give you guys my feedback as well. So you can see regular Huawei headphones. Okay, so let's peel the sticker off. I'm, I'm planning to get the Huawei NM card, but I'm not sure whether I will need that much storage. And I think it's pretty pricey too. Okay, so this is the P30 Pro, you can see right here. Okay, let's take a look at the side. Let's see, let me try to get it in focus. You can see there's the power button, volume rockers, the usual affair. And on the other side, we do not have any button at all, or any SIM ejector. We have nothing on the left side, on the top. We have IR Blaster, as well as our secondary noise cancelling microphone. On the bottom, we have our SIM card tray, primary microphone, USB-C, charging connector, as well as our, mic as well as our speaker grill. Okay, as you can see, this phone does not have a earpiece of any sort because the earpiece is actually inbuilt into the screen. 
so it actually vibrates the whole display so you can hear the other person talking so it's pretty cool but I'm not sure how that would work but anyway we'll be testing that out too okay so on the back that's where the whole attraction is so you can see Leica branding you can see that periscopic camera right there and also our wide and regular cameras so you can see a 40 megapixel camera and also ultra wide lens and on the bottom here I'm not sure you, you can see this this is actually the time of flight sensor as well as our laser autofocus and flash so the usual affair right there you can see on the other side Huawei and that's about it for the back so you can see this is a very nice finish similar to the P20 Pro so I really like the way they finish their phones because it's really nice and reflective but of course it catches a lot of smudges as well can't help it with all glass phones okay so there's been a um, very quick unboxing on the Huawei P30 Pro I just got it about an hour ago so I'm really rushing to get this video done and I can't wait to actually test out this camera so that will be in a follow-up video so thanks guys for watching hope you like this video don't forget to subscribe and like this video and I'll see you guys in the next one